We do expect a certain composure at Mole. Just because it's a one dollar weekly doesn't mean we're without standards. You uh, act like it's real and you can go to Kinder Care, but you're not doing it here. When did that app get those graphics? <laughs> not in Lake Wind! So on our display for the next match, not gonna lake one doubles, so that's doing all kinds of Ooh. things. Ooh. Alright, uh Beehawks is playing Ganondorf. What's that about? Um, I have no idea. Ooh, he's in the corner. So I've tried Ganondorf against Ice Conquers. What do you think? It's Ooh. It's not as bad as you might think. Oh my god. Oh uh, no Oh you didn't you didn't get the regrab. So Ganondorf has some nice things on ICs. Uh, he can kill them super, super fast. But at the same time, he lacks he lacks a lot of the mobility that you really need to stay away from all. Yeah. You know, you know what's kinda like what's kinda sad about this is uh, so he's on Yoshi's and he hasn't like really done anything to challenge Smog center stage. So he just like stays on the fringe and like he grabbed after a while. Also, since none is a level one, mm -hmm. when she's at lowish percent, yeah. which she will be most of the time, mm -hmm. since Ganon's gonna kill her so fast, because she's a level one. But, uh, yeah, but you gotta like realize that. Oh, I gotta go yeah. kill Nana and like make sure you're not getting nailed by Popo. Oh, yeah. it, it's tough. Uh, like, it, I think that's like the real reason why like ice climbers are so good against low level players, because like you'll get like Nana and then you get hit by down smash or something. Uh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> because if if you focus too much on Nana and overextend, then Popo can punish you for free. Especially when you're a character like Ganondorf, who only really has one fast aerial. Eh, two. He's got two fast aerials. And now, I was talking to Dizkid about what to do while you're getting wobbled. And for one, you try to mash out. Right, right. And after a certain point, I mean, mashing doesn't matter anymore. Yeah. Um, you, you'll pop out as soon as they mess up the wobble once you've masked a certain amount. Um... And so he says, at that point, what you should really be doing is figuring out how you got grabbed. Why am I getting wobbled right now? What did I do? And don't do that again. And, get, and calm down, too. That's that's so huge. Yeah. Just take a second to breathe. Don't totally ignore the wobble, because ice climbers drop wobbles. Nobody's perfect. But, like, I think after, like, 70% oh, or, like, 80%, it's like, you're kind of done. Yeah, like, you're yeah. you're pretty much dead. Um, I've, I've lived a few, but... It, it, it does not gonna happen. Yeah. All right. There's a free grab back here. There we go. Mm. All right. All right. I like the taunt. Hey, Ganon. The 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 main advantage Ganon has is once he touches an ice climber, he can pretty much always kill. Him. Especially if it's a grab or a counter. Well, it's a good thing he's got a good platform game. But like when he's oh on, no when he's on the ground, what does he do against like like random wave dash in folks? Uh, that's all. Why are they okay. on the same yeah. Yeah. So uh, if if Ganon's doing um, most a, a, a lot of Ganon's neutral is about balancing between his three F tilts, mm -hmm. jab, and like fading fair yeah. kind of thing. Yeah. Well, more fade back air because uh, fading yeah. fair is really slow. Uh, uh, fading fair works kind of once you've already got your opponent. Coming in, so it's like after the initial information exchange. Yeah. yeah okay. All right. Cool. It's it's usually not something you want to do early. Uh, it it'll work against really really aggressive players, the kind of people who want to come out of the gate and punch in the mouth. Uh huh. Um, they'll they'll eat one fair, maybe two, and then if they know it's good for them, they'll back they'll, off. They'll and slow the roll. It, yeah. Uh, but back air, back air is nice with Ganon because it's one of his fast areas. So Ganon can. Short hop bear and then like double, double jump, jump bear, bear, and he can like short hop bear, double jump up air. He can also do up air, yeah. Which up air, Ganon's up air lasts a lot longer than Falcon's hey. up air. Does it all as far as uh, you can jump out of it? Okay, you can you can do short hop up air, double jump up air. Okay, um, and then wave land. Uh, so, oh, with the taunt. So now the reason Biax taunted on that platform is ice climbers can't really get up there safely. So also, he figured the smartest thing up there. He's also just a bad person. Well, I mean, like, Hungry Box like tries to do like that whole like mental warfare thing, and so many fuckings want to be Hungry yeah. Box. It's like, yeah, I don't get it. All right, all right, story time. Once I played 
I played D-Hawks at a mole. Yep. And he started ledge planking me when he was down 3-1. <laughs> That's a bad idea. <laughs> I was like, whatever. Because wasting time is only good for you when you're winning. <laughs> yeah, I mean, like, that's not how it works. Now, there's something to be said about kind of recollecting yourself if you're if you're freaking out. Oh, that was an ill-advised F-Smash. Although, it's rare to see Ice Climbers grab the ledge after their uh, singleton squall hammer. Uh-huh. Well, he was so high, that was capable. Wait, can can they even grab the ledge off that? If if the move ends completely. Okay, okay, yeah. Yeah. So once, it's, once it's really we'll, long. Yeah, well, yeah. once they're in special call, they can do it. Oh, yeah. So that that is Ice Climbers 101. Someone tries to cross up your shield, wave dash out down smash. Down smash, it's one of the fastest down smashes in the game, and it comes up behind them. Mm-hmm. And there's two of them. Uh, yeah, by itself, it's actually kind of a bad move. But. It's fast, it's fairly strong, and with two of them, it's a great move. With one of them, it's passable. Yeah. Not a bad smash by any means, especially with that wave dash. So Biox is doing a lot better. It seems that he is committed to not committing. Which, but the thing is, if you, like, advertise that, you know, I'm not going to commit, and they, like, know it, then it's, that's when things get dicey. Yeah, you need, you need to kind of sit on the fence so that while you're staying safe mm. you're not giving them free avenues to come at you you know, you, you want to give the person a reason to stay away I've never really understood how like Ice Climbers ever win this matchup oh man they, they think Icy's win it yeah I don't know if that's I mean, the being bad or there might be a reason for it, but I just don't know. Like, how do you... Like, a character that's so reliant on grabs against, like, a character that's not on the ground that much? Well, that that might be just it. That Ice Climbers don't mind so much when Jigglypuff is far away. Maybe. But, I mean, like, she floats, like, high enough to get around their stuff and can, like, cross them up. So, I don't know. Maybe they know something I don't. They probably do, but... Uh, yeah. Another thing is that... Ice Climber's up smash is actually really strong. That's true, yeah. So they they have that kill move against Jigglypuff, and in just about every matchup where Jigglypuff loses, it's because of some super strong kill move straight up in the air. I'll, uh, uh, Nona taunt. Nona likes to taunt. Although uh, it seems like Smoke's having a hard time with, uh, with Puff here. Yeah, he can't get in, and he can't stay away. He's not really getting grabs in good situations. None is dying early a lot. Oh, that's a oh, all right. All right that was, that you, was a good, yeah, good, you, you good can cover, also though. do you can also do things like that where where you can cover multiple options, mm -hmm. and a lot of that can stuff Jigglypuff's approaches since that up air is so good and there's a wobble. Yep. You also don't have to wobble as long, which isn't a huge difference. But every bit of oh no oh yeah and trying to crouch cancel is not going to get you anywhere. Beam will forwarding B Hux to keep his cool. There we go. And he's got one more stock to take. A little shaken. Let's Gotta see how he's going to breathe. He's put himself in the corner. There's an opportunity here. Uh, it's kind of gone now. I'd have gone in. Yeah. I, I mean, <laughs> the, the thing is, like, really, in order to get, like, consistent offense against ICs, you got to, like, hit them when you have advantage, too. Because, like, if you don't, then they just kind of, like, slide away. Definitely. Yeah. Plus, I, uh, Blizzard seems like a really nice tool. Yeah, that that could easily have been down throw up smash. What you said about Blizzard is actually pretty true. Because, like, it cur the hitboxes curve upward. That's, like, annoying. They're all really yeah. tiny. Yep. I don't think Jigglypuff can clash with them with Nair or something. I don't think any aerial does. Oh. Oh, okay. I thought, I thought that chance. was going to be a grab, but Jigglypuff got that last hitbox at the bottom of down air, which gave the weird, I'm on the ground and I can't move kind of hits them. Yeah, oh, yeah. no. Oh, he got out. He, he wasn't in position to have He's the wall. A second oh, chance. come on. So uh, right there, he did a really good job not keying none too much. Oh, he missed the Nair. All right. 
So now smog. Oh jeez. No. He's still living. Uh, he's he's got one, maybe two of those left. Don't overcommit. Slipping in between the nares. There's the up smash. 99% mm. real early. So it looks like Ice Climbers can kind of wave dash in underneath Jigs' full hop. Yeah. And cut through any aerial she wants to do. So. He just blew his he blew his load too early on those edge yeah. guards. Let him back. Nakamura and Cosmic. Definitely had a shot. Let him back to the ledge if you like don't know where he's gonna go. Harry, get away from Harry, the Yeah, I would I would much rather oh, I gotta have, go, I gotta go play Louis. I'd much rather have my opponent on the ledge than on the stage. All right, good content. All right, I'll see you, Bears fan. See it. Uh, Louis, where are you at? Who do we got coming up next? Who's walking up to the stream? Looks like we have Harry. And a person whose name I should know, but I do not. 